welcome to our channel's latest episode. Today, we're diving into the recent outing of Ryan Reynolds and his wife, Blake Lively, as they enjoy a romantic dinner together in NYC. Let's delve into the details. After completing their latest film projects, Ryan Reynolds and Blake Lively seized the opportunity for some quality time together. The power couple, parents to four young children, managed to arrange childcare for their night out on Saturday in New York City's West Village. Choosing the charming ambience of Buvet Restaurant, known for its celebration of European craft and design, Reynolds and Lively indulged in a cozy dinner. Emerging from the restaurant, the couple looked happy and content as they strolled arm-in-arm arm through the bustling streets. Blake Lively exuded casual cool vibes in flared blue jeans paired with a black and purple sweater over a white t-shirt, topped with a stylish black overcoat. Adding height with white platform shoes adorned with a large buckle, she carried a chic brown leather purse. Meanwhile, Ryan opted for a laid-back ensemble featuring dark pants, a blue puffer vest over a charcoal shirt jacket, and black and white sneakers. Carrying a doggy bag filled with leftovers, he led the way back to their luxurious loft in the Tribeca neighborhood. As proud parents of four daughters, James, Inez, and Betty, the couple's evening didn't end there. Blake took to Instagram to share exciting news about her alcohol-free collection of sparkling mixers, Betty Buzz, and her sparkling cocktails, Betty Booze, becoming available at majestic wine stores in the UK, Scotland, and Wales. Lively's venture into the beverage industry began with the launch of Betty Buzz in September 2021, offering a variety of non-alcoholic mixers. She later expanded with Betty Booze, gourmet, low-alcohol, sparkling cocktails, in June 2023. As we conclude, we appreciate your viewership and hope you found this segment enjoyable. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates. Until next time, have a wonderful day.